welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a tiny waist workout. This is going to be an ab workout. It's really going to be focused on strengthening the core and just tightening the whole area up. But remember, to get a small waist, you also need to focus on fat loss. So it's very important to stay in a caloric deficit to make sure we get our waist tiny and snatched. And now's the perfect time to introduce you to today's sponsor, which is Noom. I have been trying out this program. So doing some research, I saw how many people Noom has helped to reach their goals. So I thought I would go ahead and try it out for myself. Noom is basically a behavior change innovator. So they leverage science and psychology to help people live the healthy and fulfilling lives that they deserve. It is essentially like a coaching and nutrition program to help you live healthier lives by changing long-term habits. It's not not like a cookie cutter meal program or plan. They do have recipes, a calculator, a grateful database, but you also get paired up with a coach, an actual person you can talk to. The thing I like most about Noob is that the focus is on learning. They actually teach you concepts so you can carry on with you throughout your whole life. They have daily lessons and journaling exercises to really help reframe the way you think about nutrition and a healthy lifestyle. They label foods as green, yellow, and red. We do stress all the time that red foods are not bad. You are supposed to have red foods. As a matter of fact, around 25% of your diet is supposed to come from red foods. But it was really hard for me to get over of the association of red equals fat. But it doesn't mean that. Red just means that it's more calorie dense, meaning it has a lot of calories versus how many nutrients you get from the food and how filling it is. Because even I, as someone who has studied nutrition and fitness, this is probably the first time I really dive deep into the caloric density of the foods. I can discuss any concerns you have with your coach and I will help you guide you through it and help fix little things or concerns that you may have. This is my third week using Noom. I will be doing a whole full length video of my experience with Noom. I also want to hear from you guys if you have used Noom before, what your thoughts are on it, what your experience was on it. If you haven't tried Noom yet, you can go to the link in my description and take a quiz. It is a 30 second quiz. Another thing I want you to know is that they are sponsoring me, but they are sponsoring me for an honest review and I make this very clear with them. And before I even took them on as a sponsor, I did my due diligence, I did my research and I really liked what I saw, all the testimonials that are out there, they are really, really incredible. So if you do try it, I look forward to hearing your feedback and your experience. And so far in these last three weeks, I have lost around four or like, yeah, like I've lost four pounds of some sober weight that I've been holding on to for some time. I'm just trying to tone up a little bit. So, so far, so good, you know? So if you'd like to check it out, you can check it out through the link in my description. And thank you, New, for sponsoring this video. Alrighty, guys, let's go ahead and get straight into the ab workout. All right, so we're gonna start with your first exercise, which is bicycle crunches. I love this one, especially because it targets the oblique. So we don't wanna do too many oblique exercises, but just enough where we get that nice little line going down the middle and it helps emphasize your waist. Make it look super smashed. So, we're gonna bring opposite elbows, opposite knee, and switch. You can do it this way, or you can actually do it with your arms here. Ooh. So, we're gonna do 30 in total. Let's go. Listen, planks are amazing if you've 
follow my channel, you know I love vacuums. Vacuums are the way to get a tiny waist because they target your transverse abdominis. But with planks, planks target your whole core, but they hit the transverse abdominis as well. So we're gonna get into plank position. And we're gonna be doing a plank twist. So in a plank, make sure your back is straight from your neck to your tailbone. You're gonna twist to one side, take a little dip, and another side. Let's do 30. Show my love for you, show my love for you. Taking the chance, stuck in my head, not gonna leave it at that. Taking the lead, feeling your heat, just wanna give you my, give you my best. Like this. No, okay, that's all we're doing. You are actually 
pulling the belly button to the spine. So you just have to keep trying it until you get it. So your lungs should be working separately from that. So let's try it one more time. Breathe in. And bring it to your spine. Because those ups and those downs is what makes it worth it. where Noom takes me and I'm excited to give you my full length review and to hear your own feedback. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next workout.